hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel so this video i'm going to show you a simple trick that you can use to bypass all spread trams chipsets okay so this 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 method is going to work for all spread tram chipsets so if you have a phone that is locked to frp this is how you are going to bypass it using this free tool it's a free tool and free technique that you are just going to learn today just in case because very few actually know about this technique so here you can see this is my phone and it's a night phone locked to frp you can see the lock and i cannot skip this screen the wi-fi setup screen so the simple trick is press simultaneously volume up volume down and the power button at the same time for about six to seven seconds don't exceed seven seconds because the moment you do that your phone is going to power off and restart okay so what you do just hold volume down volume up and power button at the same time for about six to seven seconds and release the buttons and once you release the buttons go ahead and unplug and replug the usb cable to see if it triggers the usb debugging port okay so as you can see on the other side i'm opening up the tool which is help tech tool it's a free tool that you can download and i'm going to leave the link in the description just in case you're interested in this tool it's a free tool okay so again i'm repeating the process and you can see for this time i think i overpress the buttons up to eight seconds because the phone actually powered off so i'm going to I'm going to reboot it in just a second and go ahead to see if the phone was able to open usb debugging or not so this is a free thing it's a free tool make sure you watch up to the end because this is interesting guys so with this actually i'm going to skip the video because these phones you know they take years to boot so this is my phone actually after it's booted and immediately it triggers allow usb debugging so what you do you go ahead and allow usb tap on allow on this device and the allow button okay so once you do that uh, everything is done because the rest is going to be sorted by the tool but what i noticed on this device is that once i did that my tool still could not recognize it because you can see from my left bottom corner there is that red mark and that red it shows that the device is not connected and it's supposed to be in green once the device is connected so i'm trying to replug in the usb to see if my device can be connected or not i could re repeat the same process or just reboot the phone or change the usb cable to see try trying to find out where the problem is because i'm pretty sure i allowed usb debugging so maybe i could repeat the process uh, or maybe i could restart the phone i'm just trying it for the last time and see if this could not help then maybe i would restart the phone or change the usb cable so you can see still it shows my device is connected but they are telling me to allow usb bugging and yet i allowed already so what i did i had to restart the phone and allow again okay so in just a few minutes let the phone boot up and we do the rest of the thing this is very simple guys it's not hard okay again tap on allow on this device you know and certainly my color changed to green showing that the device has been connected successfully and once that is connected just head over to android section and adb and tap on frp then come down and tap on start and in just a couple of seconds the device is going to unlock this tool is going to unlock your device in just a few seconds and here it shows done by harab tech tool okay so once you see this then your device is ready to go this phone after this step it does not suffer a bot okay so you have to do it manually just press power button and restart the phone and after your phone has restarted we are going to see this works like real magic it's very simple and it works on all spd chipsets so feel free to use this guys i will leave the link in the video description just in case you're interested in this again i'm going to skip this startup 
process because it takes so long. And as you can see, it is right on the home page and it is loading apps. No skipping, no startup process. It just takes you right to the home page. This is the power of Hub TikTok and it's amazing. I'm going to leave the link in the video description just in case you're interested in this. And if you like this type of content, be sure to hit that like button subscribe to my youtube channel share it with friends who could be interested in these kind of videos and until next time bye bye and take care